Hey, what's going on guys? What's going on YouTubers? I'm going to talk to you today about how Mexico's president called initial wise or an acronym AMLO, Andres Manuel Lopez Obrador. He is in denial. Uh, Lopez Obrador is wrong saying that Mexico is safer than the United States. First of all, the murder rate in Mexico is at least seven times higher than that of the United States. Okay, what he was referring to is the increase of American tours to Mexico and the number of Americans coming to live in Mexico. But the areas where Americans are coming to live in Mexico or they're visiting is Cozumel, which is an island off of Mexico's mainland that is relatively safe. Acapulco is not safe anymore. Uh, Cancun is not safe anymore. Cruise ships have stopped going to Cancun because drug cartels have shot up beaches over there. And the Mexican border towns used to be flooded with American tours, but they are now empty of American tours, particularly the town of Juarez. Juarez, Mexico used to be filled with American tours looking for a good time, cheap entertainment, and bargaining for like goods and products. But the American tours to Juarez have disappeared. Uh, 60 Minutes Australia did an interview, and I'll just use her first name, with a girl named, a lady named Alejandra. And Alejandra's mother used to be one of Mexico's most fearless journalists. And she started speaking out against the, car the drug cartels. And once she did that, um, the cartel shot and killed her. Um, when Alejandra will take her relatives, like her nieces, uh, to go get ice cream and stuff, um, the niece says, let's wait till we get home to eat it because she didn't want to eat it like on the streets outside because she, the niece was worried she was going to witness an execution. The cartel's executing somebody. And Manuel Lopez, Andres Manuel Lopez Obrador also said that Mexico does not have a fentanyl problem. That because in Mexico, apparently, even med medicinal fentanyl is outlawed. But the cartels will take the fentanyl and put it in pills that look like Xanax or Oxycontin. Well, the Mexican military recently had raided a fentanyl lab in Tijuana, and it had 1.83 million of those pills, of fentanyl pills, in that lab. And you're saying that Mexico doesn't have a fentanyl problem? Mexico doesn't have fentanyl? No, it does. And a lot of those fentanyl is produced in Mexico, and it goes to the United States. Mexico has surpassed Colombia as the nation's number one drug-running country. And that says something. It's four different cartels vying control of the, the border towns, um, Mexico, between Mexico and the United States. And it is just horribly dangerous in those border towns right now. And it's dangerous mostly in Mexico. Uh, Cosmo is fairly safe. Costa Maya is fairly safe. Progreso, Mexico is reasonably safe. But beyond that, a lot of Mexican towns are horribly dangerous right now. Where I live in Mississippi, it's about one-third Hispanic. And there's a lot of them that aren't going back to Mexico. Um, even for visits because it's gotten so dangerous over there. So anyways, hope everybody's doing well. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye.